Hi, my name is Jennifer Berkland. I'm an assistant professor in landscape architecture at Cornell. Um, I'm going to share with you a quick sort of innovation that I had early in the pandemic last year in the spring. Um, in landscape architecture design studios, oftentimes we have a site, we have a project that we take the students to and I rent a giant van, everybody gets in the van, we spend the day together, have lunch, get to know each other. And unfortunately, uh, my trip was planned the week after school closed last year. So I wasn't able to take the students to Syracuse like I had wanted. Um, so essentially what I came up with as a new way to sort of visit sites without necessarily putting anyone at risk and not having to sort of um, deal with issues of social distancing and the fact that so many of our students are now around the world um, is I used a low-tech sort of VR technology um, as a way to virtually include all of the students that were in my course. So I asked each of the students to go online and purchase a Google Cardboard viewer. It's super simple. They cost like $7. You can even make your own out of cardboard if you want. Um, but I asked them all to purchase one of these viewers because essentially you, they're very simple and you can take your phone as the sort of photo taking and viewing device and place it within the viewer and then um, experience virtual reality and a simulation of another place that way. Um, so each of the students once the university had sort of shut down were at different areas around the country and around the world so I retrofitted the assignment to, rather than us all looking at one place, I had them all select sites that were close to where they were um, going through quarantine. And I gave them a series of sort of very easy applications where they would essentially go and they would photograph their site and they would create photo spheres that essentially would stitch together a series of photos um, for v viewers that weren't there. And then the other members of the class would be able to sort of virtually visit their fellow classmates' um, sites. So it was really sort of fun. We got to take trips to California and Arkansas and Michigan. Um, and it was definitely, a, I think, a, a good conversation to talk about how virtual reality, um, as well as sort of virtual image and environment could benefit us at a time like this. You know, how to feel like you're somewhere when you're really in the same place <laughs> for a very long time. So um, yeah, so this is something that I thought worked rather well. Um, it was rather fun and engaging. And I um, talked to the Cornell Chronicle about it uh, last year after it was over, but definitely something I'm going to utilize in my class again this year. So thanks.